Hello everyone, thank you for watching. I'm at the studio at the moment, just finished uh, teaching a class and we were doing a little bit of breathing uh, at the beginning and the end of that class um, and it was one of my oh, favorite breathing practices, exercises um, and I've been, I've been doing it quite a lot recently and sharing it in, in a lot of my classes so thought I'd share this one here as well um, as I don't think I have shared it online yet so um, I love this one so much because like I can sort of really feel it in my body um, and I appreciate that you know it's it it doesn't do that much for others that's okay because it's actually really quite subtle and we're not really doing much um, but that's actually also why I love it so much because it is really simple uh, we're not actually manipulating our breathing we're breathing just normally and then add the power of our imagination and add this kind of focus to to the breath um, so it kind of means I could do it anywhere I could do it sitting on the bus I guess or, or walking or uh, you know I could very easily maybe use it as a sort of little focusing before going into meditation for example um, I've been sharing it a lot in the yoga classes uh, that I that I do focusing on uh, on the back and on dealing with some back pain and back tension and back issues of some kind of form so uh, in the context of maybe a slightly more therapeutic practice or a sort of healing practice that you might have I also find this breathing um, I don't know just quite powerful is quite a big word but I, I do I do really like it so here it goes um, and like I said, it's really quite quite simple. There's nothing to it. You sit comfortably in any position that you like, on the chair, on the sofa. You could lean back against something. In fairness, this one might be uh, kind of a little bit more effective if you are not leaning back against something, but otherwise really choose your comfortable position. You could do it with your eyes open. You could do it with your eyes closed. I'd always suggest to find somewhere a little bit meaningful for your hands to rest. So I'm sitting right now on the floor, so I've got my legs, my, my hands on my legs. So that means the weight of my arms is not putting quite so heavy down on my, on my shoulders. That means they're not so heavy on my lungs, and so I can breathe a bit with a bit more ease. And as I'm settling and getting comfortable, like I said, we're not actually really going to manipulate our breathing. It might be that you find it easier to have a slightly deeper breath for this. But what we're really doing is adding a little, I guess, visualization. We use the power of our imagination. And we imagine that we could inhale and send the breath down along the spine, all the way down to the sit bones, into the pelvis, towards the earth. So we imagine that we could breathe outside the system between the nose and the lungs, that we could actually send the breath along the spine and downwards along our vertical axis. And that on the exhale, we could release the breath out to the sides and away, to the left and to the right, and, and maybe across the, the width of the shoulders. So across our horizontal axis. So as we inhale, we imagine we send the breath down the spine, all the way to the base, into the sit bones, towards the earth, into our seat. And as we exhale, we release the breath, we let the breath go to the sides, wide, across, maybe across the width of the shoulders across the horizontal axis and that's it already and I might just sit with that with this breathing and this focus for one minute maybe five minutes maybe ten minutes doesn't really matter uh, if you're watching this 
and want to have a go, why don't we just practice it for one minute or so together. So maybe you're deepening your breathing ever so slightly, that's fine, but at the same time you really want to make sure you're not putting any effort into your breathing. Your breathing is calm and relaxed. Normal breathing is fine. But then you really focus, you bring your focus to these two directions, to your vertical axis, to your horizontal axis. And you imagine you could breathe along those directions with your inhale and your exhale. You just imagine that that was the way, that that is possible, that that's how you breathe. And observe what that feels like and how the body might be even responding to that. Notice, observe with every breath. And yes, this exercise is quite subtle, so it might be that the anchoring of our focus is not quite strong enough and our thoughts wander off and get distracted by something and that isn't a problem. Don't worry about that. If you notice, be grateful that you noticed and then you come back, you come back to the breath and to your vertical axis and your horizontal axis. You inhale, send the breath down your spine towards the earth. You exhale and release the breath out to the sides across the width of your shoulders. So there you have it, one of my favorite breathing exercises. I, as with everything, you know, it sometimes takes a little bit of practice and repeating it and kind of, um, uh, you know, kind of re, what's the word? I can't think of the word. <laughs> um, you know, just really letting the body get the the message of it in a way so give the body a chance give the body some time and a few repetitions so there's a reinforcing that's it um for it to really sort of sink into into the body of what this breathing is doing and then actually it doesn't take many rounds at all so when i now practice this because i've done it quite a lot um there really is an instant response in my body to this so i could literally do it anywhere I'm going, anywhere I'm sitting, if I feel a discomfort in my in my body, in my back, if I feel maybe a little bit agitated or stress arising, or maybe even during my asana practice on the mat, if I feel like oof, something is a bit stuck, or you know, I could just pause for this sort of moment and breathe this way once or twice and work with this breath in my in my asana. Um, and as I said, that you know, sort of come from having done this, this breathing quite quite a lot. So my body instantly remembers, uh, you know, kind of what's happening and, and can go there quite quickly. Um, so yeah, I don't know. Let me know what you think. If you like it, what it feels like. If you have any questions, as always, love having your comments uh, below the video. Thank you so much for. For watching and take care of yourselves. Have a beautiful rest of your day. Take care everyone.